Good morning, family. Welcome to Morning Manor. Pastor Kenneth Riolden here, proud pastor of the Paramount Baptist Church, The Mount. Hope you're doing well today. Listen, for just a few minutes, I want to talk from the thought, move it Monday. Move it Monday. So last night I was uh, doing some cleaning and uh, I needed to to do some work on the hardwood floors, but but before the floors could be shined, the truth of the matter was it needed to be swept. Have you ever tried to just just shine the floor without sweeping it? Um, have you ever vacuumed without moving the furniture? So I, I wanted a clean house. I wanted to be able to feel like it was clean, but if I didn't move the stuff that was in the way, I was just moving dirt around. I also was, this morning, I was outside, I was working out, and I was looking at my yard, and I thought about how I wanted to put some mulch down. Mulch beautifies. Mulch uh, makes it pretty. Mulch gives it curb appeal. Here's the problem. Until you weed the garden, you're just covering up weeds. Fact is, before I put any mulch, mulch down, I need to do some digging in my garden. That's what I want to talk about for a few minutes today, that on this Monday, let's move some stuff. Let's not just gloss over it. Let's not pretend that it's not there. There's some stuff in our lives. There's some stuff in our relationships. There's some stuff in our heart. There's some stuff in our psyche uh, that we really need to move. Don't just gloss over it. Don't just pretend like it's not there. You know that thing that, that continues to be a thorn in your life. You know that thing that continues to rise up against you. You know that thing that keeps you from feeling good in prayer time, in study time. And so my challenge this morning to us, not to you, to us, is to move it. Here's, here's what I really want to say. I, I'm so sick of people that can find fault with everybody else, but never move their own stuff. Talk good, pastor. I'm tired of folk that can always tell you what's wrong with you, but never willing to look in the mirror and see what's wrong with them. And so today I want to tell them to move it, move it along, go sweep around your own front door before you try to sweep around ours. I got Bible for it. The Bible declares 2 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 5. This is from the message version. Test yourselves to make sure you are solid in faith. Don't drift along, taking everything for granted. Give yourselves regular checkups. You need firsthand evidence, not mere hearsay, that Jesus Christ is in you. Hey, don't just talk about being a Christian, but every now and then, look on the inside. How do you deal with calamity? How do you deal with trial? How do you deal with with difficulty. If you're falling apart every time something goes wrong, you might want to test yourself. You might want to move some stuff. We might want to check our faith. Faith is the substance of things hoped for. It's the evidence of things not seen. Do you have faith that COVID-19 is going to move on down the road? We don't have evidence of that yet, but I believe it even without seeing it. All I want to say today is let's make it a move it Monday. Let's do some self-analysis, self, not everybody else, self, and see what we're able to see and what the Lord will reveal in our own lives. Amen. Pray that you have a wonderful day today. I love you with the love of Christ. Uh, we're staying connected. We're making sure we're checking on one another. Uh, we'll talk to you real soon. Peace and blessings.